So the first thing I'll do is file my nails. I like to do that before I take off the polish because I think that taking the polish off your nail kind of weakens it, so I'd rather do the filing first. And I'll just take a few minutes to try to file each nail. I know people say to go in one direction, but I really just kind of do whatever works for me that day. I know that's very unorthodox, but clip the nails that have gotten very long. Um, if you're new here to this channel, I teach piano lessons. So my hands are playing the keys a lot each week. So it's very important. I can't let these nails get too long. All right, hand one is done. Let's switch over. I apologize for the disgusting appearance of these nails. I try to do manicures uh, here at my house once a week, typically on Sundays after you know meal prepping and cleaning for the week. But this is like two plus weeks of just neglect. So these nails are really feeling it. All right, and once the nails have been filed, I like to use this nail polish remover dip it that came from Target. It actually is called Remover Dip It. And there you go, all the nails have been cleaned and they're stripped from their nail polish. The one thing I don't like about this is it really dries out your nails and the skin around them. So after I do take off my polish, I let my nails kind of soak and clean. This bowl is just filled with lukewarm, uh, lukewarm water, excuse me. I just let the nail soak for just about 30 seconds just to get all of that acetone off. But here they are nice and clean. The first thing I'm going to use on them is the OPI Nail Liqueur in the color of Schnapps Out of It, or Schnapps Out of It. Because I don't know about you guys, I'm not the best you know, nail artist, so I like to just start off with a little bit. And I'll start in the middle of the nail I will try not to touch the sides, but get very close. And there we go. Both hands are done with the first coat of polish. And what I will do is I will let them sit here for about two minutes without touching anything, just to kind of let this base coat set and dry. And once they've sat here for about two minutes, I will take my next coat, which is Sinful Colors in the shade of Hush Money. I find that this color goes really well on top of that brown mocha color that we just used with the OPI. Just like before, I'll let these sit for about two minutes before I use my top coat. Top coat today is Sinful Colors Professional, just in the color clear coat, nothing too fancy there. Does anybody else find that top coats really do make your manicure look more polished? I know they make them last longer, but I, I notice that they're just shinier and they, they do look like you just came out of a salon. And now all the nails do have the top coat on them. This time I will let them sit here for between maybe five to 10 minutes without touching anything. I'll usually have something on the TV or YouTube or something playing so I don't get distracted and then wanna move or touch anything. But that is my very quick DIY manicure. I hope you guys liked it. Let me know down in the comments if you've done this yourself, your favorite nail polish brands and colors. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. And if you're new here, click the subscribe button to be updated for any and all future videos. Thank you guys again for watching and I'll see you in the next one.